Stephanie Milkey here, a.k.a. Keto Mom, or often called mom, sis, Steffi, daughter, wife, aunt, and friend. Just like many of you, I carry a lot of titles. My favorite title is mom. I should probably say wife, which takes a lot of my time. But let's be honest. If you want to do something and do it well, you will make the time for it. Commitment is hard because we find ourselves overcommitted. But when you practice prioritizing, you will find out what is actually important and what you can let go. With the Keto Mom Podcast, you will learn together how to manage our time, commit to the most important things in life, and I will equip you with the tools you need to feel qualified each step of the way. My name is Stephanie Milkey, and welcome to the Keto Mom Secrets Podcast. Hey, everybody. Welcome to the Keto Mom page. My name is Stephanie, and I had a thought for you today. I heard it at church, and I wanted to share it with you. I wanted to share it with you real quick. Uh, because I thought it was so applicable to the Keto Mom page. So I labeled this, did I accidentally just do that? And so as you're tuning in, where are you tuning in from? How was your day? Uh, Sunday fun day, I like to call it Sunday prep day, uh, preparing for the week. What does that look like? I talk about it every Sunday. If you're not brand new here, then you hear me say, hey, take a little bit of time today. Prep your meals, prep your week, prep your menu. Are you ready to have a successful week? My question to you is, are you ready to have a successful week? But that's not what I was going to share with you today. So where are you tuning in from? We had guests in our home for the last few days. My sister should be here in like 10 minutes. She flew in from Ohio. They're here all week. And uh, I just told you that because it's fun and we're super excited. Happy Thanksgiving week. I am talking real fast, mainly because I know my dogs are going to bark in probably three minutes. Uh, but tell me where you're tuning in from. Uh, what are you thankful for? Are you preparing for this week? Uh, my sister and I are going to go to the grocery store and prepare for Thanksgiving dinner. So uh, here's what I wanted to share with you. It's not going to be long, but I wanted to give you a thought. And as our friend Brian stood on the stage at church, he's the campus pastor at our church. He, he, he talked about how oftentimes, you know, people want fat loss or they want to be financially set or you want to have a great relationship or whatever it is that you are wanting in your life. My question to you is, do you think that you will accidentally just, just fall into the fat loss? Will you accidentally become financially free? Will you accidentally have a great marriage? Will you accidentally have anything? Uh, and he was, you know, uh, the, ser the sermon or the message was great today. And he really just said, hey, you don't accidentally become healthy. You don't accidentally fill in the blank. Whatever it is you're looking for, right? Maybe right now in your life, you're like, I need to get healthy. Awesome, right? If you don't plan and if you don't stand firm in the things that you're wanting to achieve, what happens? You easily get pulled in the other direction. You get swayed to eat the donut. You easily make an excuse. People will put food in your mouth. They will say, hey, what are we doing? You will talk yourself out of it because you don't accidentally lose weight, right? You don't accidentally have a great relationship with your kids. It all takes intention. You don't accidentally have a great marriage. If you're sitting on the other side of this camera and you're like, here's what I need in my life. I need a job. I need some extra finances. I need my marriage to go well. I want my relationship with my kids to work out. I need a home. I need some groceries. I need, what is it? What is it that you need? I'm going to guess the majority of you are going to say, I need to lose weight. And I just want to give you this thought real quick. It's not going to be long. For those of you who are participating on the other side, I wish I could see your face. You can do this. Like whatever it is, if I say, hey, what are you wanting to be better in your life? What are some things that we're going to start dreaming about? Because guess what tomorrow is? Tomorrow, we're going to start going through the book called Dream It, Pin It, Live It. It is a book that's going to help you dream. It's going to help you have a vision for your life. It's going to go, where do you want to go in 2024? How do you want the rest of this year to end? Because listen, you don't fall into success. You don't fall into uh, joy. 
you don't fall into, I would say, happy. Like it's easy to fall into despair. It's easy to fall into hopelessness. It's easy to fall into like nothing is going to work out. You have to choose to go, I'm going to stand firm in what I know I need to do. So that means I need to go, listen, I need to intentionally work on my health. That means I need to have a plan. That means I need to have accountability. I need to ask Stephanie, keto mom, for some help. Hey, you know what? I want a better marriage. I need to intentionally seek out mentorship or counseling or prayer. I want a better I want I want a better relationship with my kids. I need to intentionally take my kids on a date or have communication or have conversation. Whatever it is, you will not accidentally Man, I feel like I'm preaching because I listened to this and I was like, "Oh my goodness, it's so good." We all want better. We all want whatever it is that you're seeking for. You're like, "If I could just lose the weight. If I could just get the promotion, if I could just, right, whatever it is, it's going to take intentional focus and not going, it's going to accidentally happen. My sister's here. It's not, do you hear? I've got four dogs, four girls. My sister is here with her kids and her husband for a week. We are intentionally going to have an incredible week, but I, I'm so sorry. It is going to be loud. I apologize. Please hold. Actually, I'm just going to let you go. I'm going to talk over the crazy. I just want you to think about this. Have I been hoping and have I been dreaming and have I been going, well, someday it's going to happen, but I haven't been putting the work behind this someday, right? It's not, you're not going to accidentally fall into all the fat loss or whatever it is. You need to be intentional. So what we're going to do is we're going to dive in this week of being uh, we're going to dream and we're going to have visions, but we're going to put the action behind it. We're going to get it in front of us. We're going to create a vision board, but we're going to be intentional and also write down the actions we need to take in order to have the success that you want, right? In whatever area of your life that you're wanting. So I want to say thank you for tuning in. Your presence matters. I don't know if any of you are commenting because I can't see, but I'm going to believe that somebody on here is going, oh, you're right. I don't accidentally lose the weight. I've got to put some intention behind it. I need some help. I need some guidance. If you've got questions, ask below. If you want to reach out, ask me. Ask me. Um, I would love to give you some guidance if, if I have it. Or we can go find the answer together. Uh, so thank you for tuning in. Your presence matters. As always, you can go to ketomomsecrets.com all one word, ketomomsecrets.com. Click on book club, click on trial packs. I mail out ketones every day. If you've never tried ketones, they're my mom fuel. Drink them every single day. Hands down incredible. Like if you need something to help you, ketones. Like uh, if you need some mentorship or coaching, send me a message. If you need some guidance on how to eat, I will help you. Ketomomsecrets.com, click on recipes. Whatever it is, I hope you guys have an incredible day. Be intentional. Take some time to plan out your week. Uh, reach out with questions. And again, thank you for tuning in. Your presence matters. I'm going to go chat with my sister. Super excited they're here. It's, it's a wonderful week. If you're in the United States, it's Thanksgiving week. Um, and that's all I have. So have a wonderful day. We'll talk to you soon. Bye.